Hi, we're Kent and Pam Temple. Welcome to Real Talk with the Temple Team. Today's housing market is hot. Home prices are at all-time highs, demand is high, and interest rates are low. There's one question we get asked a lot, especially by those homeowners who remember going through the housing market crash of 2008. Is this market turning into a housing bubble, and when will the bubble burst? Yeah, I remember 2008. Although we're living in unprecedented times and no one has a crystal ball, most experienced agents, and economists as well, believe that we are not gearing up for another big crash. There are many differences between the market today and the market of 2008. We're seeing key indicators that lead us to believe that the housing market will eventually cool, yet do it gradually rather than crash. Number one, mortgage applications are trending down. Mortgage rates still remain at historic lows. Despite that, according to the Mortgage Bankers Association, mortgage applications have gradually begun to slow. This is a sign that some home buyers may be starting to hit an affordability wall and may drop out of the market, at least temporarily. Once demand from buyers starts to go down and there's less competition, this will affect sales prices. Number two, asking prices are leveling out. Listing prices in America's biggest cities grew by an average of almost 12% compared to last year. And that's not sustainable. Yeah, and yet over the last month or two, the average has actually gone down just slightly. The number of days on market is starting to stabilize as well, especially in large cities such as Charlotte. Economists believe that this new trend indicates that in spite of the increase in overall prices since last year, this is a stable market, not a bubble in danger of bursting. And number three, mortgage affordability. One of the biggest differences between the 2008 market and today's is changes in the mortgage industry. Between lower interest rates and stricter lender procedures to ensure that all people are qualified for the loan amount, people are buying at a level that they can afford. That's right, because lenders are following stricter lending standards and obtaining that money is more affordable, a cooling off of the market will not result in a huge foreclosure crisis, which is a huge part of what led to the housing crash of 2008. Home prices may be up and home sales high, but in actuality, today's market is falling much closer to seasonal norms than the market of 2008. What is important is that if you're thinking of selling, these indicators and slight shifts in the market also tell us that now is the time if you want to cash in on your home's value before things start to slow. Just give us a call at 704-235-3000 or email us at info at the to get started. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe below. From our home to yours. See you soon.